Game Plan, a parent's guide to youth sports. Sponsored by Children's Health, Andrews Institute for Orthopedics and Sports Medicine. Our Game Plan series has been so well received, we've got more. More tips for parents and young athletes. Time management so important, especially when the calendar fills up. How do you juggle it all? Our newest member of the Channel 8 sports team making his on-air debut with some help. Here's Jonah Javad. So if we do better the second time, will you take our second grade? All the way home, Annie, you ready to ride? Annie Flory walks through the halls at Cedar Hill High School. She's a senior now, and nearly every person she passes greets her with a smile. Good job. Thank you. You see, academics come first for Annie. She's the projected class valedictorian with scholarship offers to Baylor, Trinity, and Texas A&M. But Annie is no one-trick pony. No, there you go, Annie. she has five of them. And she competes in barrel racing all year. When she's not horsing around, you can find Annie catching some rays as the starting catcher for the Cedar Hill softball team. Yeah, that's a lot of responsibility, but there's no need for the world's smallest violin because Annie plays a real one in her school orchestra. She's also president of the Honor Society, she's on the student council, and she's involved with her church. Which leads us to one simple question. Annie, where do you find the time to do all of this? Sleep is optional, life? for sure, for sure. At first, it started as a resume builder. You know, you think, I'm gonna be honest, that's what you do it for. And then eventually, I've, I stuck with it, and I'm like, I really love this. And somehow, she still finds time to be a teenager. Are you able to at least do things that, what are you, 17, 18? Yes, I go to the movies, you, still you know. You go to the movies. You still go hang out with friends outside of school. According to her mother, Polly, Annie's ability to prioritize and manage her time started when she was little. She was exposed to a lot of different activities. If they've committed to it up front, then you hold them to it and you hold them accountable from a very early age. And that is because in the future they know how much they can handle and how much they cannot. That's an accurate statement. Yes, you're exactly right. And you're a parent, right? One day. <laughs> but not every kid is like Annie, and sometimes being over involved becomes, well, overwhelming. So, here are some helpful tips from Cedar Hill guidance counselor, Celillian McDaniel. We talk about prioritizing. So, what's the major focus right now? What's the most pressing and let's focus on that, making sure they're maximizing the downtime so that when it does come down to that deadline, they're not as stressed. Elena Hicks is the Dean of Admission at SMU. Parents are some of the greatest support systems that we will ever have. And I also think that parents can help students know when things become frenzy, frenzied and um, maybe crazy in their lives, just to breathe and know that it will all work out right. Do you feel burnt out at all? I thought I would, you know, beginning of my senior year, I'm like, I don't know how I'm gonna finish this year. And now <laughs> I'm, we're almost done with it. And I'm like, it's, it's going okay. She's very happy. And as long as she's thriving and successful at all that she does, all that she wants to do, I'm going to support her in that role. Annie now has her sights set on becoming a doctor, a pediatrician for special needs children. Jonah Javad, Channel 8 Sports.